No Hep is an international movement to end hepatitis in the world by 2030. Hepatitis Australia is the Australian peak body for hepatitis. TASCARD is the Tasmanian Council on AIDS, Hepatitis and Related Diseases. Hepatitis is very common in the world. It has been called the hidden killer of our time and is the seventh leading cause of death worldwide. Despite this, it has been left off the global health agenda until recently. In 2016, a global commitment to free the world from hepatitis by 2030 was signed, and it's a real possibility if we all work together. This video is about hepatitis B. In many places in the world, cases of hepatitis B are increasing, including Tasmania, Australia. But what is hepatitis? Hepatitis means inflammation of the liver. The liver is the body's largest internal organ, responsible for many important functions. Hepatitis B is the most common liver infection in the world. The hepatitis B virus enters the body via the bloodstream and travels to the liver, where it attaches to healthy liver cells and multiplies. Hepatitis B can lead to cirrhosis, scarring of the liver, and in some cases lead to liver cancer. In fact, 78% of all liver cancers are caused by viral hepatitis. Worldwide, 240 million people have been infected with hepatitis B, and about 600,000 people die every year due to the consequences of hepatitis B. Hepatitis B prevalence is highest in Sub-Saharan Africa and East Asia. Most people in these regions become infected with the hepatitis B virus during childhood. Australia has a lower rate of hepatitis B than many other countries, but rates are rising. It is estimated that more than 232,000 people have hepatitis B in Australia. It is estimated that more than one third or 77,300 people do not realise they have hepatitis B. In Australia, the hepatitis B vaccination program has been running since 1988, with the vaccine becoming widely available in 1996. Children born in Australia after May in the year 2000 have been given a hepatitis B vaccination shortly after birth, then at two, four and six months of age. Children in year seven or adolescents aged between 11 and 15 years who have not already been vaccinated receive a two dose course of adult hepatitis B vaccine given four to six months apart parents must give permission. But how do we get hepatitis B? Hepatitis B is a blood-borne virus. You can get hepatitis B from blood-to-blood -blood contact and bodily fluids. You can get hepatitis B from unprotected sex, unsterilised needles and medical equipment, and sharing personal items which could cause minor wounds such as razors, toothbrushes and nail clippers. The most common way that hepatitis B is transmitted is from mother to child during childbirth. There are no clear signs that you have hepatitis B. Only a blood test will be able to tell you. When you first get hepatitis B, it is called acute hepatitis B, and many people manage to fight and beat it, after which they are immune.
If your immune system does not beat the hepatitis B virus, it becomes chronic hepatitis B. If you get hepatitis B when you are young or when you have a weakened immune system, then you are more likely to develop chronic hepatitis B. Ninety percent of infants who get hepatitis B will have chronic hepatitis B for life. Thirty percent of children who get hepatitis B will have chronic hepatitis B for life. For people with chronic hepatitis B, the virus can become active later in life and result in serious health conditions. To find out if you have hepatitis B or if you have already been vaccinated, you can request a blood test from your doctor or book an appointment with your closest sexual health service for free. The test will give you a lot of information. The test will show if you have hepatitis B, if you've had the vaccination, or if you've contracted hepatitis B and developed an immunity. We are lucky to have access to the hepatitis B vaccination in Australia. You may be able to get the hepatitis B vaccination for free. Ask your doctor. To get the best protection against hepatitis B, adults should receive three doses of the vaccine at zero, one and six month intervals. Then you will be protected against getting hepatitis B for life. If you have hepatitis B, treatment is available and you will need to take extra care of your liver. Talk to your doctor about the options available to help you live a long and healthy life. You may wish to tell your family and encourage them to be tested too. And you will be able to stop the virus from being passed on further, helping the world end hepatitis by the year 2030.